This new battery is located under the rear seats, ensuring a lower center of gravity and optimized space in the hatchback cargo area. Although official EPA certification is forthcoming, Toyota promises all-electric driving range will increase by more than 50% over the outgoing model, estimate 37 or 38 miles in F-mode. An available rooftop solar panel can help replenish the battery when parked, and power accessories while driving. When running as a hybrid, the 2022 Prius Prime scored a 54 miles per gallon combined fuel economy rating, slightly better than the standard Prius 52 miles per gallon score. Given that the new 2023 Prius is targeting 57 miles per gallon combined, it seems likely that the new Prime's hybrid efficiency will rise, too. The electric propulsion system is supplemented by a 2.0-liter I-4 engine, up from the previous 1.8-liter mill. It remains connected to a planetary-type continuously variable automatic transmission, CVT, and front-wheel drive. All-wheel drive is available only on the standard Prius hybrid. Working together, this battery and motor give the Prius Prime a huge power increase, now 220 horsepower, up from 121 horsepower. The standard Prius makes 194 horsepower with forward and 196 horsepower with AWD. As such, Toyota estimates the Prius Prime will accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 6.6 seconds, downright rapid compared to the 10.0 second result our test team measured from the outgoing Prime. Equally important to regular driving, Toyota says the Prius Prime's accelerator responses have been tuned to feel more like those of an all-electric vehicle. Screens and buttons applied harmoniously. Inside the Prius Prime, Toyota earns a nod for not joining the industry trend of eliminating physical buttons in favor of digital everything. Hard keys for HVAC controls are placed on the dashboard, drive mode options are on the center console, and a variety of other functions are seen on the steering wheel, which looks borrowed from the brand's BZ4X all-electric crossover. Yet there's no shortage of pixels. Like in the BZ4X. The Prius Prime's driver looks at a digital gauge display. An 8.0-inch infotainment touchscreen is standard on the SE and XSE grades, while a 12.3-inch unit is optional on XSE and standard on XSE Premium. Both screens come prepared for wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, dual Bluetooth device connectivity, and future over-the-air updates. Every Prius Prime includes six USB-C ports, and the XSE Premium will have a wireless charging pad. Furthermore, that range topping trim offers a digital rear view mirror, semi autonomous parking capability, and a surround view camera system. Self driving capabilities come standard. Like most 2023 Toyota models, the Prius Prime will come with the Toyota Safety Sense TSS, suite of driver assist and active safety features. When pricing is announced in the first half of calendar year 2023, expect it to start a few thousand dollars above the standard Prius. At this year's Los Angeles Auto Show, a new wedge-shaped automobile with far more power than its predecessor makes its debut. But this is no rodeo drive-bound exotic, it's the 2023 Toyota Prius Prime. Although it's still far, far, from a hybrid supercar, the redesigned Prius Fev hatchback promises better performance, tech, and range, not to mention, aesthetics, than any Prius before it. Wait, the Prius looks cool now? Like the equally new 2023 Prius Hybrid, the one without a plug, the new Prius Prime receives a gobsmacking glow-up. Admittedly, the old model set the styling bar about high as a Toyota Supra's ground clearance, but the newest Prii, the identical-looking hybrid included, might be the first to ever beckon shoppers with its design, rather than mere affordability and efficiency. We suppose someone at Toyota finally asked the question whether stylistic self-flagellation for the sake of MPGs was necessary. Taking a sleek aerodynamic shape, the body carries dapper sculpting and clever details like hidden rear door handles. Based on an updated version of the TNGAC platform, the wedge-like Prius is roughly 2.0 inches shorter and 1.0 inch wider and longer than the previous model. Most eye-catching are the thin LED headlights, which wouldn't look out of place on a sports car. In fact, there are amusing parallels between the Toyota's headlight design and, well, the same pieces on the latest Ferraris. Unlike the outgoing model, the new Prius Prime's body is essentially identical to that of the standard Prius. Toyota is differentiating the Prime by positioning it as something of a performance variant in the Prius range. The SE, XSE, and XSE Premium trims it's offered in our denominations reserved for Toyota's sportier trim level pillar. Toyota's L-based designations such as L, 
La, and Exili are reserved for more luxury-focused models, and are the only offerings on the regular 2023 Prius, acute cursive prime tailgate badge, unique wheels, interior trim, and an available clear lens for the LED tail lights are the Primes, um, prime design differentiators. The most powerful and electric Prius ever. A subtle detail seen only on the Prius Prime is what looks like two fuel doors. In actuality, gasoline goes in on the driver's side flap, while electricity flows into the passenger's side charge port, which has a fitting for a J1772 connector to replenish the now lithium-ion onboard battery.